guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys like this video, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys into the video. And today what I'm going to be doing is showing you guys how to make a logo, because I wanted to show you guys how to make a logo, because some people in my school wanted to make a logo. Actually, I, I have two friends that wanted to make a logo. And, uh, their channels will be in the description. But, yeah, um, I already have a logo and a banner. So, I'm gonna be, guys, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make a logo this time. And next time, how to make a banner. Okay? Okay. So, let's just say I make my own logo. Okay? So, you know how my logo has a curve on the bottom? Right? Okay. So then, you take half of it away. Oops. This is just, like, the quick way to do it. No. Cut. Okay. So then, you basically have an outline. So then, I'm gonna go out a tiny bit. Then, I'm gonna go like that move it to the middle downwards okay and now I am going to grab this go close because you want the pixel measurements okay Okay, wait, that was, I was just testing something there. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to get the right angle here. I will fix that later, but you can easily fix that by cutting it and then putting a line like that and then forming it to this part. Okay. Then you do that. Then that. And then there. I'm doing this fast. So if you took your time with it, you could make a pretty good logo. Just remember, when you make your own logo, you got to think of something you like and then go for it and then see what happens and after you see what happens and you like it use it see what people think of it and then yeah uh i'm just trying to get the right angle here And if it takes you a few tries, it probably will. I can easily fix that. So, like, if it does that, it's okay. Because then you can go back and easily fix stuff like that. Okay. And go like that. Then, these are going to go like that. Because... My logo has these things that are on the top. I can draw my logo two ways. I have my logo where it's straight. That's not straight. I need this tool right here. And that is like that. And I will fix this afterwards. Like, this isn't even done. Oh my god. I don't like when that happens, but it's fine. Okay. Oh, 
Okay, so as you guys see, this looks disproportionate than it actually is. I will... No, okay. Um, I have my logo, but you're like, oh, how can I make this look better? Could I do something like this, then this? That's the wrong tool. Something like this, go straight up. And then you can keep like doing stuff like this. I got to restart that. Just like keep testing and when you test Okay? And this moment I'm going to do this and that and delete that. Okay. What size would that be? That might be half. And then like that. And then like that. Okay, that's just a visual. Okay, yeah, that looks a tiny bit better. Okay. So, now that you have your logo, you delete all the corners that you don't like. Okay. Okay. Delete this one, this one, there we go, and then you grab this filter, no filter, but you grab this, and then you go like that until you get it how you like it, and then you touch it up more, and then you touch it up more. Then you even touch it up more. <laughs> yes, yeah, sometimes you'll do something that you don't like. But that's fine because you're testing. For you guys, you probably don't have a logo or you're thinking of making a logo. But you don't know how to put it on your computer. Um... So, what you do is you get a program like this. I don't know if you guys have the same program as me. If you do, this is the first program I've actually used to, what is it called? To actually make my logo. I never actually used my logo. I actually only used my logo for basically a few minutes and then I replaced it with another one. I have that I have it. I don't know if I can show it because it's basically like this, but I don't think I I might have it. If I do, it'll be at the end of my video because of my in outro. But yeah, if it is then yeah. And today was my birthday. Just so you know. I'm going to put a banner, not a banner, I mean a background, because, yeah, because it's cool. Okay, now I'm going to do this, okay. I'm going to customize the blue, and that's fine as well. If you customize the blue to your own standards...
add. Okay? Then you do that, and then it pops out more. But when you add something that pops out more, you start to notice some differences from your logo, if you have one, to this. And I just noticed one. That would be... Can you guess? This part right here. I'm just going to delete like an entire section. It's already been 11 minutes. That's cool. Okay. Now grab the red and do it how you like it. And then, there you go. That's an easy fix right there. Um, maybe grab one side and push it in. Yeah, that looks better, kind of. And then I will fix this part by erasing. By erasing that part. And then grabbing the red. And shaping it to that. To the background. And then there you go. And that's not the right color. There you go. And it already looks better. How could I make this better? Maybe by putting a B there. B. That's not how big my logo is. So you, like, logo size. So you can resize it. One hundred and thirty. 30, too big, okay, then you go lower to 10, no, to 20, then you go lower, because that's still too big, to 10, okay, and then I'm going to go to 5 here. Oh, wait. It should be zero five. Okay, that's about a good size, won't you say? Okay. Yes, you don't see it. That's why I'm going to do that. This is a really simple task, but... People can mess up on it, so when you do that, you instantly grab it, you put it where you want it. Okay. You're like, oh, that doesn't make sense. That is, um, this part is orange, and this part is blue. That doesn't make sense. Well, watch this. One simple thing. There you go. It's basically fixed. And then, I still don't like this part. What could I do? I could do something like this. Delete that. That part. Right. Then, turn this part to red. Grab that. And carefully draw it. There you go. And I think this should become bigger. And there's one thing I forgot right here.
Okay. Starting to look like my logo. Right? But now, let's just say you want to fix something on it that you think is really hard to fix. Well, you could think it's hard, but you just have to learn how to do it. If Okay, look. You can make a perfect logo, but you could think it's the, it's great, but then you still want to improve it as well. That is what happens with YouTubers with bigger subscribers. Okay. You guys got that? And, uh, yeah. That's, that's basically how you do that. I'm slowly making it my logo. And remember, if I had time, way more time than I have in this video, I would make my logo better. So, like, you guys should. And this is just a rushed version. I already have a version that I like. I'm just showing you guys how to make one. From the start of this video, from the end, I barely even, I didn't even have anything on this thing. And now I already have a background. And I just realized that this white part was here. And I'm repres-repres- Well, I don't know what that's called. Repres- Okay, never mind. Re-putting- Okay, I'm putting that somewhere else. Positioning. I'm re -pre 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 Okay, never mind. I'm not talking about that anymore. Okay. Then I grab the- The red? <sighs> And I'm going to do something like that. No, wait, actually, go back. Okay. Now I'm going to fill in the spots. Okay. Now you're like, why is there a clip right there? Well, you can easily fix that by doing that until it should line up when you color it. And if you guys have any questions, just ask, and if I see it, or in the comments, or if I know you somehow, like you're my friend, you can tell me, and uh, yeah, I, I will do the video that you want. But as you can tell, I turned a rushed thing into a better one and if I could this is kind of bothering me if I could I would get this part I would get this and rotate it but I don't know how to do that on this program but I knew how to do it on another one it's called Google Docs because you can get photos and other photos So yeah, that's how you do that. It's 20, 20 minutes I've been doing this. Okay. How much, how long have I been working on this, you guys think? Well, you guys will know. I have been working on this for 20 minutes, and I just got this. Imagine working on it for two hours, three hours, four hours, a day, a week, a month. Imagine that. This would turn into a masterpiece. It would turn into 
a really good logo. But, I already have a good logo. I have one right here. 